In this video, I will show you how to import into your N10 instance the N10 workflows of other people which they are saving in JSON format and sharing either via Telegram or maybe in the school community, how to actually get this JSON file and make it running in your N10 instance. So let's imagine uh, we are having a workflow which I demonstrated in one of the videos uh, on this channel. And this is AI News Digest with Perplexity tutorial. So normally how it looks like, I, uh, I upload, I sent here the JSON file and you can see it looks like this. So JSON, JSON file is, a, is just a normal text file, uh, just the data there is stored in JSON format. So whatever you see on the NA10 screen is represented, uh, it's, it's possible to represent it in JSON. It includes such nodes as schedule trigger, for instance, and there are other parameters related to schedule trigger nodes. So whatever you set in the NA10 uh, user interface uh, is actually also duplicated here in this JSON format. In order to use the uh, JSON uh, workflow, which has been created by someone, someone else, all you need to do is just download this on your laptop. So here I'll just right click and I'll say uh, save as, and I will save it uh, to my desktop. That's gonna be AI News Digest Perplexity JSON file. It's already there because I already saved it. So I have it on my desktop. So what I do next, I go to NA10 and uh, this is just the starter uh, screen of the NA10 and I just uh, start from scratch with a new workflow. Just press start from scratch. Here is just an empty workflow and in order to get the workflow which I demonstrated during the video and which I have stored as JSON format, all I need to do, I should just come here, uh, press these three dots and choose import from file. And here I will choose the file uh, from my uh, desktop. The one. And as you can see, just like this, you have all the information. It includes all the uh, all the boxes which I draw, uh, drew on this workflow, the colors, the names of these boxes. It has all the nodes. So for instance, if I open a schedule trigger, it says that the trigger interval in seven days and it triggered at 7 a.m. Exactly the things which I, which I have done in my uh, tutorial for. And uh, the only thing which is important, you can, uh, you can actually immediately see here that some of the nodes like this one, perplexity, it has this exclamation mark. It basically means that this node as of now is not functioning correctly because you should connect your uh, perplexity credential. You should just double click here and in, in the credentials, you should either create a new credential or you should just choose the credential for perplexity. And once you have done it, then uh, your workflow will be set up and it's gonna be completely a copy of the workflow which I demonstrated during my tutorial. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. If so, please like it, subscribe to Unreasonable AI, join our Telegram community. And if you have not started yet to use NA10, use the affiliate link in the description below. It will cost you nothing. And in this way, you'll support the channel.